Chapter 1. Success Starts with a Vision Lesson 1. No one ever became successful on accident. I challenge you to redefine success for yourself. Though success is what all of us strive for, success varies widely to each person. To some, to live comfortably and be able to afford everything that they need to find success. While to others, success means to be abundantly wealthy and be able to afford everything that they want for themselves, family, and friends. So, what does success mean to you? There is no one precise way to achieve success. There are many roads that lead to this place we so covertly crave. But one thing for sure is that no one has ever become successful without first having a clear vision, then a plan to materialize that vision, and finally executing that plan. You can get a vision while you're asleep in a dream. You can get one while daydreaming wide awake. Perhaps it comes to you in a flash, or someone paints a vivid picture in your mind by something great that they accomplished, or even by something that they casually implied. Vision is what molds our world. The TV programs we watch, the cars we drive, the beds we sleep in, and the houses that we live in all started out as somebody's vision. Some visions are small, small like paper clips or toothpicks, and some grow as large as stadiums or skyscrapers. Some visions are dormant inventions, and some are potential accomplishments. When you do get a vision, it's up to you to keep it vibrant. You have to come up with ways to keep that vision vivid on your mind's canvas. If you don't immediately capture your vision with a physical depiction, like jotting down your vision on paper, intricate details of it can be easily forgotten. Forever. Lesson 2. There is magic in words. That's why they call it spelling. The art of visualizing. The key is to paint a picture so clear that you actually feel like you're there. What does success feel like? What does fine dining taste like? What does your dream house look like? What does peace of mind sound like? What does your interior of your new car smell like? Visualize the life that you want and everything that you want to accomplish. Visualize everything that you want to have, where you want to live, your dream career, your dream mate, your dream kids, your dream bank account. Take a moment to close your eyes right now and visualize your dream life. Can you see it? Can you see yourself counting all that money? Can you see yourself living in that upscale neighborhood? Can you see yourself at your dream vacation destination? Can you see your kids in a private school? Can you see yourself relaxing out back alongside your crystal blue pool? Can you see yourself getting the respect you deserve from your colleagues? Can you see the world buying your quality products? Lesson 3. No one ever becomes successful without first seeing themselves there. Take a few minutes every single day to close your eyes and see your future the way you want it. See it so clear that when you open your eyes and come back to your current living situation, it makes you feel uncomfortable. It makes you want to do something. It makes you want to get the life you know that you deserve. At first, you may feel silly visualizing, or your picture may seem fuzzy, but visualize until your future is as clear as the present. How does it feel? Capture that emotion. Bottle that feeling. Learn to harvest that inspiration so you can reap it in the moments when you need it the most. Don't worry about believing it yet. Just start by visualizing now. The more you visualize, is the closer you'll get to bringing your vision to life. Create a constant reminder. You have to keep that vision in the forefront of your mind. Some people do so by creating a vision board, a goal board, a wish list, or simply by listening to songs that inspire them on a daily basis. I encourage you to come up with creative ways to keep a grasp on your vision. Perhaps making an audio file describing the life you want to create, and speaking your vision into the voice recorder on your phone so that you can listen to it regularly. You don't have to set a lot of time aside to visualize. You can incorporate it in your daily activities, like while you're in bed or while you're exercising. 
You can even listen to audio recordings while you sit in traffic or when you have downtime at work. Find ways to create automatic reminders. For example, take a photo of something that represents your vision and use it as a screensaver on your computer or use it as a screensaver for your cell phone. You can make a photo keychain. You can get your inspirational image printed on your favorite coffee mug that you sip coffee out of every morning. I've seen people get small tattoos of things that represent their ultimate dream so they can constantly feel inspired. Personally, I keep motivational books on my coffee table. I keep a little sticky note on my laptop, and I use bookmarks with motivational quotes. I recently created a collage of people who inspire me and placed a photo of myself amongst them all. Create your own unique reminders. There are so many ways you can motivate yourself subconsciously. Lesson 5. Your subconscious mind is the most powerful tool that will help you to accomplish your goals. Guard your vision. Guard your vision with your life. Guard it from the naysayers and the dream killers. Like Will Smith said in the movie, The Pursuit to Happiness. People want to tell you that you can't do something because they can't do it. If you have a dream, you have to protect it. With that said, don't share your dreams with just anyone. The beginning stage of your dream is the most vulnerable stage of your dream. If it's shared with the wrong person and they sarcastically or cynically dismiss it, then that can shut your whole dream down and smash it to pieces even before it begins to shape. Keep your vision a secret until you start making progress. Keep it private until you start implementing your plans and until you're strong enough to know that you'll keep pushing forward no matter what anyone says. People who say your dreams are impossible have already quit on theirs. Grand Cardon.